Subscribe now to join Team Fresh. What's going on, T Fresh? Welcome back to a new GTA 5 mods episode. Today we have something amazing. I just got an invite from Mosley Shop to test drive one of their fastest cars. Yo, so I don't What's know up? where they got this car, but it's literally the fastest car in GTA 5, and I'm super pumped to be test driving it. I guess they have it for sale. So I don't know. Maybe we'll steal it at the end. Who knows? You guys know how my episodes go. They kind of go on the fly. But anyway, we are headed over there right now it's only about half a mile away and i'm super pumped it, it's supposed to be like the fastest car we've ever driven on the channel so yeah <laughs> once you guys see it make sure to leave the guess for the top speed in the comment section down below stay until the end of today's episode we will test out the top speed then i think the top speed is going to be something insane uh i think i already passed it actually let me do a quick huey here I think the top speed's gonna be, my guess is gonna be 812 miles per hour. Yeah, all right. Here we go, we are pulling up on a location. There should be a manager here waiting for me. All right, let's go inside and see if we can find them. This is like, uh, they've updated this place quite a bit. Mosley's shop. And I guess they have some of the, uh, the best uh, performance mods. But here we go, this is the vehicle right here. We just got to get the keys from the guy. Where is he? Check it out. Let's take a quick look at the car first. This is nothing I've ever seen before. It's like, it's impressive. So, I'm super pumped to be driving it today. Super futuristic. It's got like the old school hot rod look uh, mixed with like super futuristic aerodynamics like sports car. I don't know. It's like all in one. All right. Where is this guy? Come on. We have to go for a quick little drive. Dude, I kind of like this place now. Oh, there you are. What's up, man? What are you doing here? Let's go. Let's go. All right, guys. So I finally got him inside the car. What's up, man? We got some really nice racing seats over here. And he's looking at me as if, like, it's my first time driving a car. He doesn't trust me at all. But anyway, let's start this thing up. It sounds absolutely insane. Wow. All right, guys. So I think it's time for us to take it on this quick little joyride. Are these going to open up? I was going to say, oh my gosh, I don't want to damage this car. It must be. It must be crazy expensive. Look at that. It just does donuts all around the place man this is crazy is this okay with him are you okay with this i guess he's used to that he probably did this himself right before he came over it's doing burnouts over 150 miles an hour some of our cars that we've driven haven't even gotten like haven't even hit 150 miles an hour this car is doing the burnout in like first or second gears doing 150 uh-oh Dude, I knew that police officer turned around to go after me, but now we have one star wanted level and we're effectively escaping police. Is this okay with you, buddy? Are you fine? <laughs> oh no, he's not happy. He's not happy. Dude, please don't damage this car. Oh my gosh, he's not happy. He's giving them the finger. <laughs> okay, all right, let's go, man. Dude, I can't wait to do a top speed run at the end of today's episode. Man, controlling this vehicle is very tough, by the way. It just seems like I know what I'm doing. But this car, look at that. 200 miles an hour we just hit. And the tires were still spinning. Whoa! Damn. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Is this car still okay? It, it's fine. It's just this crepe. It's just this crepe. It's gonna be okay. Dude, I'm a two-star wanted level. And... It's gonna be so easy evading cops in this thing. Just because it's so fast. Uh oh, brakes. Here we go, we got. Whoa! Hello, officers. Didn't see you there. <laughs> oh my gosh, I can't wait to do the top speed run. Yep. Whoa! I haven't even left the guess for the top speed. Uh, but I think it's gonna tap out around 
I think I did, but I didn't give like an exact number, but I think it's going to tap out around 820 miles per hour. That's just going to be my guess. Leave your guess in the comment section down below. Stay until the end of today's episode. We will test it out then. In the meantime, this car can do 200 miles an hour in like seconds. Alright, let's try and hit this jump right over here. Alright, go, go, go. I can't even like keep it straight. Look at that. It just goes left and right. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wow. <laughs> the car is fine. The car is okay. It's super like low profile. It looks like the roof has been cut like in half. And that's why there's not a lot of drag going on. Well, obviously, there's a bunch of spoilers, so there's a lot of downforce, but we need it, guys. We need it. The car just slides, like, left and right. It's very... Oh, dude, what is going on here? It's very hard to keep it straight. All right. Let's try and lose the cops. We'll be fine. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to give this car back to him, honestly. We might just drop him off back at the, at the dealership and just drive off. He can have my retro Comet that I left over there. But I really just like this car a lot. And we must add it to our car collection. You guys already know. We have to. All right. Let's try and lose the cops now. Should be easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. All right, go this way. We're already losing the cops, actually. All right, let me go this way. The cops are coming from up north. They're not going to see me over here. It's going to be perfect. Um, let's take a look. Where do I need to drop them off? Uh, right over here, actually. Yeah, right where my car is. We're going to drop them off there, and we'll be fine. The cop just kept driving. We're good, guys. We're good. This is easy. This is how you evade two stars. So simple, you just hide somewhere. There's no helicopters, so it's super, super easy. There we go, just like that, we have lost the two star once at the level. <laughs> and uh, his place, well, the dealership, where uh, we took this car for, for a joyride, for a test drive, is right around the corner. All right, I'm just gonna drop him off and take off, so. All right, buddy. Thanks for letting me test drive this thing. It's all beat up right there. Lord. <laughs> he's running away. I don't, I don't know if he's trying to get security or whatever, but or maybe he's just really scared, but I got to get out of here. I'm going to keep this car, obviously, just because it's so unique. It's so fast. It's literally the fastest car I've ever driven in GTA 5. And uh, let's go and test out the top speed of this car. Now, I'm going to warn you guys, it's going to be probably nearly impossible for me to keep it straight on the test track. So, um, yeah, keep that in mind. And uh, let's go test it out right now. All right, guys, we are ready to test this out. I'm not even going to do a burnout because it does a burnout by itself. All right, we're going to try and keep it as straight as possible, but... The car likes to shift left and right by itself, even if, even if you don't hit left or right. It just kind of sways in different directions. But here we go. We're doing over 300 miles an hour. Let's hit it. Four, five, six. So oh, 697, and we flew off. 697. Let's try this again. I know we can do a lot faster with this car. Here we go, guys. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, guys, I know this car can do a lot faster. It's just a matter of keeping it straight on this test track. And there is nowhere else I can test out the top speed that's wider and this long. So here we go, guys. Let's try this. 620. Oh, my gosh. Here we go, guys. 712 miles an hour. Just blink. That is absolutely incredible. I know this car can probably do over a thousand miles an hour, but there's literally physically impossible for me to open it up, unfortunately, on this runway. There's all these different things that we can hit, and the car just goes sideways so quick. But uh, yeah, if you guys guessed it, 712, 
miles per hour is going to be the top speed that we physically could do on the test track, then great job. But on this note, I'm going to end today's episode. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to smash that like button. As always, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.